today, Marquette alumnus Dwayne Wade shared that he's making a $3 million transformational gift to grow literacy and scholarships and help fund a new men's basketball practice facility. Please turn your attention to center court where Dwayne Wade is surrounded by young student readers from the Tregill Wade Johnson Summer Reading Program. 24 years ago, I got an opportunity to come to this university because of opportunity. And that's what it's about for my, my family and I, my sister and I. Um, you see these beautiful kids around me. They are part of our literacy program. And that's what today is about. It's about our donation, not only back to our literacy program, but about our scholarship program, about the basketball program. We want to make sure that kids in communities like us, at risk, inner city, have opportunity to attend a university like Marquette University that could change your life. I think it's kind of fitting that we're sharing exciting news on Dr. Martin Luther King Day, who has often said that education was the key to unlocking everyone's potential. And I think what Dwayne's gift is going to do today is really going to unlock the potential for a number of students in Milwaukee to help them not only reach their potential, but to thrive and, and make a big difference in the world. When I think about what Marquette University stands for, yeah, he really personifies it. So Dwayne, thank you for everything, and I thank you for this gift. Thank you, Prez. I appreciate it. Um, too much is given, much is required. That's the model that, that I've lived by for a very long time. Coming to Marquette University, I was given a lot. And because of that opportunity, um, I've been able to translate that into a lot of successes. And if you've ever had a conversation with a parent that kid has been impacted by something you've done, it's no greater feeling. And so my sister and I, my family and I have always been about understanding that even in the moments in life where we haven't had a lot, we've still been blessed enough to have something. And so giving back has always been in our DNA because we know where we come from. And so this gift that, you know, that, that we're giving was impactful, um, not only to the basketball community, which, you know, is very important to us, you know, the reason that we're all, all here is because of this game of basketball. To have my name down on that practice court, it means everything to me. Super thankful for this moment. Uh, super thankful to, to be a part of a university that cares in a way that Marquette does. I give a lot of credit to the building of relationships from Prez and also to Coach Shaka. We've all built something pretty special. And Villanova coming in, you know, we in a little, we're in a little moment right now where we're not where we were in the beginning of the year. Our confidence ain't where it was. We need to stop that. Our food don't taste the same right now. The jokes ain't as funny as they were. Feels better when you win it. Now we got to pull from each other. All right, so this is the opportunity that you guys get, man. This is a story y'all get to write. Love you guys. Yeah. Shaka has opened up the, the locker room for me anytime I come around. How we feel? He puts me in there and right in the middle of the guys. Don't just practice hard. Do everything that way. Proud of y'all, man. You know, I want the players, not only just at Marquette, but players in college basketball, I want them to see all the things you can accomplish and all the things you can do. And so, you know, tonight I know they're out there battling in the way that they should be, but I want them to understand that this is what the after can look like. You know, this is your opportunity and potential you can have. You're not just coming to a university so you can get to the NBA. Like, you know, this is the after for, for everyone. And so to be a part in a big way, and uh, that's important. And so leading by example is something that I've always tried to do. And so I hope you guys join us and continue to rise up. That's why I'm standing here today. So thank you guys so much. Hope you guys hear more about what we're doing.